little trick that you may have seen out there is a trick I like to call best buds. It's actually when two dogs give each other a hug. It's really adorable. I'm going to show you today in a few simple steps how to teach this to your dog. My name's Kale. This is my five-year-old Border Collie Grand Slam. Welcome back to McCann Dogs. You should know before we get started that in order to teach your dog to do a best buds, your dog should already know how to do a wave on command. Wave, 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 good boy. If you haven't taught your dog to wave, then you can check out the link above for a trick tutorial on how to teach that to your dog. Once your dog knows how to wave, the next step is to see if you can get them to wave and accidentally hit something. Now, Slam is going to do this really easily because he's already had some training before, but I'm going to use the same process as if he didn't know what he was doing. So once his paw comes in the air and he touches this stool, I'm going to yes and then reward him. Wave. Yes. Good boy. Wave. Yes. Good boy. Wave. Yes. Good boy. So he's very easily touching the stool with his paws. So now I'm going to change my command to the command that I want to use when he's doing uh, best buds. Best buds. Yes. Good boy. Good best buds. Yes. Good best buds. Now I'm rewarding him several times for keeping his paws up on the stool. Okay. Good boy. Ready? Best buds. Yes, good. I'm also rewarding him in a way that it encourages him to remain in position. If I was to feed him like this, yes, and bring him down, it would discourage him from keeping his paws on the stool. Try one more time. Best buds. Yes, good man, buddy. Excellent, yes. Now, once your dog's comfortable putting their paws up on an object, the next task is to add a dog. Now for the final part of this trick, I've brought in Slam's best bud, Funky Monkey. Now she is a nine-year-old All-Canadian, and uh, she's going to hopefully sit here patiently so that Slam can practice his best bud. So he's had lots of repetitions of touching the stool and getting a reward, so now I'm going to see if he'll transfer it to the dog. Ready, Bing? Best buds. Yes. Good. And I can reward. Best buds. Yes. You probably should reward the dog <laughs> getting touched as well. Best buds. Yes. It's really funny that you're going right for her head. Yeah. Now what we want for Slam to do is to actually put his paw around Funky rather than on her head. So I'm going to try and reward a little differently now to see if I can make that happen. Best buds. Best buds. Best buds. Try again. Best buds. <laughs> yes, fun. Good girl. Best buds. Best buds. Good. I'm going to reward over here. Best buds. Yes, there, yes, good. Best buds. Good. Good, sit. Yes, good. Best buds. Try again. Best buds. Yes, good. Yes, there, good, best buds. Yes. Good. Now, this trick is adorable for photos, so my favorite thing to do is get to the point where I can get behind the camera, so that's where I'm standing right now, so that I can get it on verbal. So I'm going to ask him for best buds. Yes, good boy, wait. Yes, excellent, best buds. Yes, good boy. If you have any questions about how to train this trick, make sure you post those questions below in the comment section and we'd be happy to help you. If you like today's video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. If you wanna see more videos about trick training and other dog training information, please subscribe to our channel. For now, I'm Kale, this is Grand Slam and Funky Monkey. Happy training. <laughs>